Roxette is really good stuff if you want a semi-permanent thread locking solution. The stuff is great because it has an extremely high heat tolerance, unlike Loctite. It is also water soluble, making it removable. For these reasons, it's popular for muzzle device attachments like this PMM compensator, which uses shims and rock set to set the compensator. It's a really solid mounting solution, but it's hard to remove. My issue was this, my front sight post became loose because like an idiot, I didn't bother blue lock tightening it before rock setting this comp to my barrel. To remove it, you have to get water in the threads. Running it under water isn't going to be enough because water won't be able to get between the threads. The internet has suggested wrapping it in a wet paper towel and then applying heat with a heat gun for 20 to 30 minutes. This might work. The idea is that the vapor should be able to get between the threads as water has issues because of capillary action. It's apparently science, just go with it. But I didn't have a heat source that would get this hot enough to work, so I tried to use a clothes steamer. I tried cooking this thing like a marshmallow over the steam, but no bueno, this approach did not work for me. The only thing that worked for me was boiling the thing for about 30 minutes in water. Every now and then, I take it out and let the water vapor surround the muzzle device and comp. Supposedly, it isn't the heat that breaks down the rock set, it's the water, but I don't know. This is the only thing that would work for me. The first attempt, I was able to break it loose a little bit, and then it wouldn't budge, so I boiled it again for another 10 minutes. I think the loosening created a little more space and let more of the water get in between the threads. That was then enough to muscle this thing off. I then soaked the components in water for another 10 minutes, while this time I loctited the front sight post properly to the slide. Then I reassembled and reapplied just a drop of rock set this time in case I ever need to take this off again. I did scratch the comp up a bit getting it off, and honestly I should have wrapped it in something, but I had a lot of trouble getting enough leverage to get this thing off. This is on a PSA dagger, so it isn't exactly a showpiece, and this isn't a safe queen, and I like my firearms having a worn look, but everything is functional again, so there's that. You can roast me in the comments section about bubba the finish, but hey, I didn't destroy my barrel or the compensator, so I count it as a win. And speaking of winning, my encouraging message for this video comes from 1 Corinthians 15.57, which says, But thanks be to God who gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. So even as frustrated as I was trying to get this muzzle device off, or any of the annoyances and frustrations of day-to-day -day life that remind us in small ways that the world is still broken, if you're a believer, you can always reassure yourself of future victory, secured through what Christ did for us over 2,000 years ago. Have a great day, guys.